Hey guys, it's Neil and Matt from the Skullbusters. And uh, what we're going to do is we're going to talk about some of the information on Battlefield 5, uh, some gameplay details that have been released. So, do you want to go through some, Matt? And then. Yeah, I'll go through some. So, to Battlefield 5, the uh, gameplay details. So, there's no longer auto health regen. So, you basically yeah, you can't. Can can't but basically yeah, if you regen. get shot you can't regen yeah you've got to pick up health and however ammo. you got yeah you got to pick up health and ammo uh, that's an animation now so it's not magic and then you got the long reviving animation so instead of just needle in the dick or wherever <laughs> it's a animation and it takes forever so you got fortifications now where you can build your own front lines so your barbed wires your machine guns or you could do defensive and have a massive gun on, I think, flat yeah, gun. Yeah, it's a flat build some of the um, brickwork, basically, you can't even guess Yeah, anything. brickwork, sandbags. And then you've got your 3D spotting moving away from the hood. And then you've got yeah, your... so they're moving away, aren't they, from the little, um, little mini-map in the corner. They're trying to get away from that so that you, you've, they're forcing you kind of to spot your enemy. Um, so. that's one thing and um, then um, on your fair calls as I noticed in the trailer and I said it yeah. you could t now tow things like a flat cannon or an AA gun um, that's pretty cool that I thought it was pretty neat but I reckon you have to unlock that you won't get that straight away yeah. I think so we want to like one of the perks yeah and then you could throw back grenades easier yeah and catch Catch and, and throw catch. back grenades. Yeah, to capture yeah. everything. That would be pretty good. That imagine that would be some kind of trophy or something or service assignment. I'm guessing if they bring them back in, catch like ten grenades or something and get kills by throwing them back. Something you know, something ridiculous, won't they? They always do. So okay, so, Matt, I think we should talk about the uh, Battlefield Five game modes. Right. So War Stories are back. I think I think they're gonna be bigger, and better, and um, yeah. I think it's gonna be more of them because there's a lot more stories in World War Two regarding yeah. those twenty-two countries or twenty-seven countries regarding that Grand Operation. So I think Grand Looking Operations. Forward. I think it's operations, but three times as bigger on a massive scale. So I reckon it could be up to. 150 people on each team or more no they can't do that surely not I, that's what i think it is or i don't 100... think it could be 64 versus no 64. i think it's bigger the way they're talking about it, i think it's about 100 um the maps on a massive grand scale because apparently it's four days yeah so it's so like, it's like stages isn't it, you said. stages of days yeah I'm looking forward to the co-op that they're bringing back. Uh, and you got com uh, yeah, yeah. co-op, which is also known as combined arms. So I'm assuming that again could be war stories. No, I think that'll be more campaign. That I think it's got to be surely. And then multiplayer. Uh, the original conquest. War pigeons, Rush, maybe. I'm guessing as well. Rush will be on there. Which is popular with a lot of fans. Yeah, because you get stalemate and all that, don't you? So you just... Yeah. Right. Uh, I don't think they'll do Domination Team Deathmatch, to be honest, because it's just too small and no one plays them, even on Battlefield 1. And, uh, Regarding yeah. the speculation for Battlefield, uh, Battle Royal in um, Battlefield 5, um, they've confirmed that there will not be any battle royal but dice are looking into it how they could work it in maybe in the future as, um, a, as a dlc or something well I, I don't think it will be a dlc i think it'll maybe an add-on or like a big update they could provide or i don't know i don't know how they want to go with that to be honest i don't think it'll work in battlefield to be honest mm -hmm. i can't see it working Battlefield 5 or Battlefield V will now have no premium. So, that basically, I think all DLCs are free. 
Not I, don't think sure. I don't know if there will be DLCs. It might just be the game. The updates, all right, okay. Yeah, and just updating it. And then you get campaign. And you got co-op, so I'm assuming co-op campaign, combined arms. Grand operation, no bullet spread. Is that just bats and fucking metal bars? Knives. No. You got the deep character and vehicle customizations, which I think could be pretty cool because you can. Again, it's gone a bit coddy though. I don't. I'm not. I don't know. I have to see how that goes. I think. If if it looks mint, then yeah. But you can customize they your do character. It right, yeah. If they do it but, right, yeah. But, if they don't do it like look, fucking yeah. old cod advanced warfare, where you can make some stupid shit out of it. Yeah. Um. You got robust tides of war live service, and we're getting the new introduction of women in the game. Which there's been loads <laughs> of um, bad feedback off a lot of people about this, but it's like today I've heard you know a lot of people say that women shouldn't be there and in the game it's not correct, but and they want on the front lines, but. They clearly was on the front lines. Um, just an example, there was a woman um, from Ukraine, uh, Pavlichenko, her name was, or sec that was her second name, and she was a sniper in World War Two, and for the Red Army, which was the old Soviet Union, and she had 309 confirmed kills, which I think is pretty badass, to be honest. I could do one better. I could go three ten. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Um, but yeah, it's, it's just a lot of people today is just saying, "Oh, it's not accurate," and all this, that, and the other. But to be honest, you know, out of everything that they've seen regarding the trailer, and all, a lot of people are just picking up the fact, you know, women's in there, and you know, the prosthetics. You know, out of all that, come on, and this, they're trying to drop. You know how accurate it is, and which a load of shit because uh, you know how many times did, in war in World War Two did a lot of people die and then respawn <laughs> and die you know like, I mean? and respawn yeah, and respawn <laughs> yeah you know how accurate is that uh, how, so, how accurate do you get fucking needle neck and then you get uh, spawn back up so I think people just got to realise it's just a game and they're trying to keep it. As hundred percent accurate as they can, but obviously it's not going to be hundred percent, is it? You know, so it's a game. Just people need to just like yeah, just chill out a little bit regarding the women thing. I think it's a good thing, it should be because a lot of women play Battlefield. Yeah, so. they are gamer girls out there or girl gamers, yeah. however you want to pronounce oh. it. So the yeah. the forces, yeah. So you got the Germans, the British, Americans, and the Russians. Um. I so far, don't forget yeah, this. We got the J Japanese. We've also got the um... got Scandinavia. So you got Norway. Yep. You got North Africa. North Africa. Like you said, yeah. So that's uh, what's that? Egypt? Not the Egyptians. Who who took part in Africa? I don't remember. And then right. <clears throat> so we've got the new game mode. This is Airborne. I know nothing about this. All I know is called Airborne. Because <laughs> that's all they mentioned yesterday. You know anything about it? I don't know. It's the only thing I can think of. Is, is it the, like Air Assault? Or is it like where... Is it on Grand Operations? Like, it's in stages. So, in other words, you've got to start from where you fly in, your paratroopers. Is it not like that? Where you, yeah, and then you've got to land. Mean, yeah. Then it could be an objective. Instead of capturing yeah. a zone, you've got to do an objective to be there. Could it be like that where, you know, like I say, it's paratroopers, you drop down, you've got to dig in before that and then build off that, do you know what I mean, to try and capture something, let's say. I think that could have potential to be good, or like I say, it's rather going to be like air assault, isn't it, or something. Yeah. I think that they've announced oh, um, there's going to be no loot boxes involved in Battlefield 5. Uh, Micro transitions will not be for uh, will be for cos cosmetic only items and won't affect gameplay because there's a bit of uh, uproar wasn't there with the Star Wars Battlefront game 
Um, oh, pay to win. Transitions. Yeah, it's yeah. got us a lot of So skill. it's skill. That's what I want. Skill. Yeah. I carry the team. Um, so yeah, EA have yeah. confirmed all that, really. So, which is good. Right, guys, that's our video on Battlefield 5 and what is included. Everything. So every give little us detail. Some, yeah, give us some feedback. Give us, Drop us some comments. Tell us what you you're looking forward to or that you're not looking forward to and yeah I don't say some feedback from guys. <laughs> yeah don't mention the women they get a bit touchy yeah right that's uh, it so yeah thanks for watching guys subscribe and adios